I'm Happy Monday and today I'm going to do an everyone video and you've all been asking so now we're finally doing it so you don't have to ask anymore so yeah let's get right on to the video so what is an everyone now an everyone is a little robot well it's kind of like a medium sized um, and it's at my school and then um, I use it by using my iPad and I have a little app on it and then um, it will load up and then there's like a little code like beep boop beep boop and then um, I'll just have to connect and then um, yeah and then I do my lessons. So what I see when I load the app is the robot and then the little keyboard and then I'll have to type in a little like secret code and then it'll like spin round um, and then it'll have a big bar called that says connect and it'll be either red and then if it's red I can connect and sometimes I can't connect depending if it's either charging and it's dead or it's on but it's not working so um to see the classroom um there is two little eyes <laughs> and then i can see i can also change the volume of how i like kind of speak kind of thing it's either i can't they can't hear me at all there's no volume or a teeny volume or medium kind of one or really loud and um the, the reasons they're there is because um then i can talk to my classmates my friends and the teacher and the whole class and the whole class only see a little robot but i can see them so it's like i see them but they only see a robot but they can hear me depending if it's on the loud one um but they can't actually see me so like they can hear me but they can't see me. so i use the everyone for school um because i am currently on the like kind of like the high risk kind of list clinically extremely vulnerable and i'm also on the shielding list so i cannot leave the house so that means i'm safe but then I can use the AV1 to do the schools. So, yeah. So the only difference is that, um, like, I'll still be doing it um, nine to three. That's like our uh, times and finishes. Um, so the break times and lunch times, um, I will do like the little break times. So there are little break times in between um, each lesson due to COVID um, and the teachers can either take me out or I can go out like come off it and then come back at a certain time um, and like I can like choose what I would like to do kind of thing um, and if I go out I can like I can either watch um, like people playing or like if we're doing like a talent show kind of thing I can watch my friends do their stuff and PE lessons I can watch the PE lessons <laughs> and there are some emotions like sad, confused, really happy and kind of kind of neutral and then this is the fun part and the lovely bit of my life is that my head on the robot glows when I would like to put my hand up and there's another one and it's like there's a little bar and it goes blue that means I'm having my quiet time what I like about the AV1 is that I can move around um, by like swiping and swiping um and i can also see it and i was i can also talk through it and i can watch people i can be out and in and 
I really like it. So, yeah. So, the only thing that I dislike about the AV1 is that um, it was, like, took me a while to, like, figure it out. Like, if the board's here and then the big board, like the drum board and then the screen board, um, and, like, I'm facing this way, and then, like, if I scroll this way, it goes that way or that way. It's confusing. Like, if I go that way, it goes that way. But it's, like, very, very sensitive, so it kind of, like, moves a little slower. Um, or it's just my iPad. Depends. Um, but sometimes, um, it, like, did take me a while, like, to, like, get it where I can go. And it does take a long time. It's so, like, if there's something on the board, and, like, I'm already facing this way, I'll have to go... <laughs> And it's very, very hard. And sometimes it like goes on and off, like it lost connection or it lost contact. So sometimes um, like it could not connect. And then like it's either, I'm talking to the teacher or the TA and like it just goes off. I'm like, oh, no, I okay, get close and um, try and uh, basically um, try and connect again and sometimes it's either it's turned off on we won't work or like I'm on like the robots basically on a um, like three battery kind of thing so lasts a pretty long time um, and yeah so I really really think this is a really good way for children who are like either staying at home and missing that off school um because then like they can like actually communicate with others and then they can actually do their school stuff so that they don't miss out so I 100% recommend this to a lot of kids that's good so this is the unloading um, screen. Um, obviously, I cannot show you um, like the classroom and like how I actually use it um, because like pri private kind of things. Um, but currently, I cannot connect, sadly. Um, but it sometimes this is basically the little bar. And then you just click on it and then it'll go and like say connecting and then if it connects then it'll work so and then there's like a what do I do now if you don't know what to do so it's either contact contact your teacher whoever your teacher is or whoever's using it or try restarting the app so I do just want to say um I use my phone for like getting the slides up. So I would say don't, um, if you can't see the board, then definitely have another device handy because then you can actually like see the questions perfectly fine. And then you can just write them down and figure it out. I give my work to my mum and she takes um, a photo that goes straight to my teacher then she can actually see it and then um try and like kind of mark it thank you for watching and if you've got any more questions just drop them down after this video and then i will do a av1 part two if you have any you've been watching don louise but don't forget there's some videos or a lot of videos with my mum on Archer's Adventures! Bye! And then like you're like, do the swipe thing. Okay.